Hi everyone, welcome to our video. We're Faye and Simon and we're full-time resellers and we are about to show you an epic haul video. You do not want to miss this one. This is uh, stuff we picked up today to sell on eBay and Amazon, which is what we do full time. And this is our first sourcing trip since before we went on holiday. So about three weeks for me. You popped out on Sunday, got a couple of bits, didn't you? But this is like first fill your boot load for ages. So do you want to show me what you clothes ready? you got? Are you so ready for clothes? clothes? Yeah, Ooh. I'm excited about this. Faye kept saying to me, I hope they're as good as I think they are. I hope they're as good as I think they are. Um, and yeah, this shop. Least favourite shop. So we have, first up, some Under Armour um, outdoor trousers, brand new with tags. These are quite a size 42, so big size, and they were five pound. So they're men's trousers, as are these Berghaus trousers. These are men's, and these ones are 38 waist, and they were four pounds pick this up and then I was going to put it back and then I thought no I can't put it back because it's a hush lightning bolt jumper it desperately needs de-bobbling um but it only costs two pounds and it's a large so yeah I'll de-bobble it do some work on it but for two pounds I just couldn't leave it behind and next up we've got I don't normally pick up fat face but I've heard people saying that now is the time for fat face tops and jumpers this one is new, I think. Was this the new one? Mm. No, this one's not the new one. Uh, that was a bit of a spoiler there, wasn't there? <laughs> <laughs> this is five pounds, men's, and it's a medium. It's nice, nice thick. How many shops did we go in today? Four, five, yes. So, so all these clothes that I'm showing you, uh, just from one shop, um, I'll tell you when I get to the end of that shop lot. Uh, a Rohan jacket. Now if you watch our videos you'll see that I picked up a load of brand new Rohan trousers from an auction and I did really well with the men's. There's still women's left but I was super happy and um, so I've been picking up more Rohan when I see it and this was an outdoorsy jacket for five pounds and um, medium. Then I've got a Rohan fleece men's size medium this was three pounds like full zip i don't know if like, this, is, this was a good pickup or not i've never picked this brand up before it's ll bean and this was three pound fifty men's jacket and it's a large nice jacket can you guess what brand this is it's rohan, rohan. <laughs> men's jacket extra large five pounds can you guess what the next one is? Rohan. No. Must I? No. It's Hertha Gruten, which I think is a, a cruise um, cruise line or cruise company based on my um, marketing background. I used to work at a travel company. I'm sure we did Hertha Gruten cruise holidays. Anyway, but it's also... Kelly Hansen and on the side it says Association of Arctic Expedition Cruise Operators AECO what's this bit all about I don't know maybe it's where like it's to stop polar bears attacking you they get stuck to the velcro <laughs> can't, can't say, say velcro, velcro. <laughs> you for that hook and loop um had a quick look on uh, eBay and they sell stop it they sell for, or ones the same as this, sold for £45. This is a 3XL and it sold for £4. There's none for sale, uh, and especially not a 3XL. I'm really happy with that. It's one of my favourite pickups. <laughs> Hopefully, you heard that um, over all the rustling. That's why I was trying to take it. Oh, off. they heard me shouting. Bye. Okay. <laughs> do you want to show a few bits? Okay, great stuff. Uh, do you want to? Yeah, I'll do that? some scanning. So I'm gonna some of the lots of the stuff Simon's picked up is for Amazon, and I'll just scan it on the app as we go, just to see what the um, current sale prices are of the bits we picked up. So here we go. First uh, DVD I picked up. So we're just gonna show you um, what we're doing when we say scanning on Amazon, just in case you're new here. 
Um, if you're a seasoned reseller and you know all about this, we're only going to do this just the once, uh, showing you what we're doing. Um, so if you're just here for the haul porn, um, then don't worry, we're not going to be doing this on every one. So it's Modern Family, uh, it's DVD with a sleeve. I paid, oh, it's uh, eighth season. Uh, I paid, uh, I didn't have a price on it, so I think it's 50p. I think all DVDs are 50p in this one. Oh, £9.58. Uh, good rank, great reviews. Now, this one I picked up. Uh, really happy with one pound ninety five. It's brand new and sealed. The Secret Life of Us season series one part two. Um, uh, it's interesting. I didn't actually spot that it was like a part two, and that explains um, what I'm about to show you. New one hundred and one pounds and sixteen p. Uh, but it's got high rank, so it's not a fast seller. Um, it is available used. £13.74. So I'll probably put this on around £30 to £40 pounds, um, and just see what happens. It's the right time of year though, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, Gillian Michaels. Your film, The Biggest Loser. Do you remember that? Yeah, I don't know. Uh, Yoga Inferno. Um, I paid £1. Pound. Did you? you? It's only available used at £5.41. Um, Benjamin, this is a surprise. Uh, I paid two pounds for this one. It's all brand new and sealed. Great rank and uh, sells for nine pounds twelve p, but there's none in FBA. Um, this one is interesting. Dead men don't die. And I paid fifty p for it. Um, it's torn. It's brand. It's, it's sealed. It's not brand new and sealed. It's it's still kind of partially sealed. So it's like used like new. New. It's twenty one. Used. It's fifteen fifty. Yeah. So I thought it was worth picking up. It's quite a high rank. Um, so it's a slow burner. But um, I couldn't leave that behind for fifty p. The slow burners are if you, if you if you're gonna have like success with slow burners, it's gonna be in quarter four. Yeah. Uh, Dead before dawn. There's a theme going on here. Yeah. Uh, I paid 50p. If, you don't, if you're not interested in DVDs, stick around um, because Faye has got some absolute belters, she assures me. I've only seen them when I was hanging up and I wasn't hanging them up on the... On the... Coat hangers? Coat hangers, <laughs> thank you. Uh, I wasn't paying any attention. I saw a couple of them in the shop. Uh, but yeah, stick around. £9.9p. Uh, class of 99.2. Again, this is a bit of a strange one. Uh, I paid £2, brand new and sealed. Is it about dying and death? <laughs> uh, in, in the future, teachers are cyborgs. Pray you only get a detention. Mm, new £41.28, used 35 yeah. So again, it's a high rank, but you know, even if I get 20 quid, I'll be happy with that. Uh, Joe Brand, Barely Live, paid £2 for this, brand new steel. That one is £10.94p, but none in FBA. Uh, paid 99p for this, Where the Buffalo Roam, heard of that, this is quite old, oh yeah, look, uh, it's old uh, Bill Murray, looking oh, very like young. Bill Murray, uh, 621 but none in FBA. When Faye says none in FBA, just in case you're not sure, that just means that um, Amazon are fulfilling the stocks, so you box it all up, send it to Amazon and Amazon fulfil your orders, and because Amazon prefer that you do that, they give you priority over the buy box or the featured box, so you're more likely to uh, to show up as a seller. Uh, this is Metro, Eddie Murphy, quite old, 99p. Uh, £6.98. This one is Blind Date, Kirsty Alley. Now, don't judge me, but I know that Kirsty Alley is an adult movie star, I'm sure she is. Yeah, didn't she used to be a bit of a hottie and now she's just gone downhill? I don't know about that. I mean, I, I guess so, because this DVD's from, I mean... Was she know, the one in Look Who's Talking? Takes all sorts. I don't know. Uh, anyway, they're in bed on the back. So, uh, you won't be coming home alone. <laughs> uh, is there a... Awful rank. Double in, entendre. Yeah, it was, a, it was one of those ones. I just couldn't leave it behind. 8.2 million. In, in books? Oh no, hang on. Do a picture. Because I'd have done a picture because the sticker was over it. Oh, that's better. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Seven pound twenty-five. Um, so the covers. There was a couple of covers. This was weird. Uh, so it's uh, a BBC. I paid ninety-nine p. It's opera. Pompeia el ultimo dia. Or is it historical? Uh, el mayor dia. 
well, whatever that says. Anyway, it's in foreign, but only available used for £43.36. Now there's no rank and blah, blah, blah. But it's one of those ones, 99p, you know. He couldn't leave it behind. What are you gonna do? Um, this is Hysteria, paid 99p. Brand new sealed. £26.78. And in loving memory. Another death one. You did yeah. alright on these DVDs, didn't I you? Did, I did. I scanned a lot of DVDs today uh, because Faye was spending a lot of time on clothes. Um, I had sort of felt like I had more time and we had a bit of time anyway. So I was really going through them. Um, and we haven't been to a lot of these chasms for a fair few weeks. So. Funnily enough, though, the first one we went in, we both said, well, I've got quite a few bits and bobs in there, but it, you were looking at media and bric a brac and toys and games, and so much of the stuff was still in there for when we went weeks ago. Yeah. Just remember these weeks random and weeks things. ago. Uh, 99p. £11.15, none in FBA. That's from 1980, that series. Wow. So that's the end of the DVDs. Um, I should probably put a sound effect in here or something just to wake you up because uh, it's clothes time. More clothes. Okay. Guess what jacket I'm gonna show you. <laughs> it's a Rohan jacket. <laughs> this one was five pounds and it's a large. Yeah, it's sort of a nice blue color, men's. There we go, put it with the other Rohan jackets. This is still all from that same shop. And then next up is this jacket. I hadn't heard of this brand before, but it's called Sprayway or yeah, Sprayway. And it was five pounds. It's a size ten. And is this the one that had Gore-Tex? Yes. yes. And I, I, I just quickly looked it up because basically the lady just started bringing stuff out. It was like a private pick, wasn't it? It, it was. was. It was amazing. She, so she just went. She told us a little story, which they may or may not mention in a bit. Um, and uh, yeah, she went off, and I just quickly did spray away jacket. Sold, I to load, and Faye will go grab it. But we'll get 30 minimum, I reckon, for that. So that's good. And then I got a new brand for me, or for us. They're, I think they're golf trousers. Yeah, they are golf trousers. The brand is Woodworm. Have you heard of Woodworm? They look quite big. They are a 42.33 and they were five pounds and they're brand new with tags. I also picked up for three pounds, a pair of, I don't think I meant to pick these ones up. Oh no. That's a bit random. Hmm. What did I leave behind that made me get these? I didn't pick up Marks and Spencer's trousers, but well, no, I did. did. You always take them you. I could take them back, so I'm going back tomorrow. How much did you pay? Three pound. Bit random. Mm. Oh, I bet there were some other golf trousers I left behind. I hope they're still there tomorrow. And then also from the same shop, I paid £3.50. They're a size small. I'm not sure if they're salad pets, but well, actually, they're probably um, sort Fish. of sailing trousers. Yeah, fishing. More sailing than fishing. Uh, oh, yeah. Musto, sort of dungarees. We've sold musto stuff like this before, haven't we? For like yes. 150, 200 pounds. So it was a massive whole, was it a whole suit. Yeah. Like, yeah. like big sort of. When Simon says fishing, he's right. But like, as in like trawler fishing. Yeah, deep sea. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Not like sitting by the river fishing. No. <laughs> Deadliest catch. Exactly. So yeah, they were three pound fifty. Um, I was so pleased with those. Yeah. So we spoke to the lady. Because I said, can I come back and have a look? And she said, oh no, I've just brought it all out to you. And I'm thinking, I don't think she gets that I want to look at uh, all of her rails. You can see all the rails out the back. And yeah, there's loads of it. So she said, I've got more coming in tomorrow. Um, and I said, oh, okay. She's like, you have to come back. I said, when's the best time? And she said, uh, about three. So I told him, uh, she's called Sarah. She knows that I'm called Faye. Okay, cool. We swap names. And... Yes. Um, I'm heading back there tomorrow, but also before I go there, I was saying to you in the car, do you ever get like a psychic calling, like an urge, like an inner urge that's pulling you to a particular chaser? Because I'm having one for something, 
another town for like 15 minutes away so I can't let it lie it's calling me <laughs> so I'm going there tomorrow and then I'm meeting Sarah the manager at three to go through her delivery right get yourself a name badge <laughs> <laughs> different stuff now uh they grab these Oh, you can't scan these. These are on. These okay. are probably for eBay. The we they need a clean. Uh, so it's Spike Milligan um, book set. We've sold that before, and then we made up our own bundle before. So this is we sold this in variations a few times. Um, but yeah, it was how much was it? Oh, uh, three pounds. I think we might be able to get about twenty five for those. Ooh. Uh, pay pick this up too. Uh, Halty, it's a dog harness. Sold one before because it was in a uh, bundle from an auction. Got another one after that from a Chazza, and then I saw this one today. But we haven't sold. Is it large or extra large? This one. Is uh, it down here? Large. Large. Yeah. Three ninety-five. Might be able to get about sixteen, eight to eighteen pound for that one. Ooh. Ooh, what's this? I don't know what this is. No, I picked this one up. So it's a Marvel Mitre football. Uh, it's a football. It's currently deflated. Comes with a pump and. Pens, so you like draw on it. You colour it in. Oh, wow! Well, it's going to get drawn on at the end of the day. <laughs> so yeah, um, that's for eBay, I think. Uh, it was on Amazon, uh, but out of stock. So uh -huh. I paid four pounds, uh, and I was pretty comfortable with that. Uh, maybe get fifteen quid, twenty quid. Who knows? Uh, oh. Oh, Monster High doll. I don't know which one it is, but I was pretty sure it was Monster High. I did a Google Lens search in the shop and it confirmed it was Monster High. I paid, I think, 99p for it. And this cabbage patch thing. Uh, this was also, this was 149. Did a Google Lens search on it again. I uh, don't know how much I'm going to sell it for, but yeah. Horrible, isn't it? It is horrible. Uh, I picked up a, a lemony snicket. We just sold a full set the other day for it had been our sales video for like 35 quid, something like that. I can't remember. Um, and I'm about four books short of another set, one of them being book one. So I picked it up for 50p. Well done. Uh, Faye grabbed this book, Naturally Nourished, Jackie Small and Sarah Britton or something. How much did I pay? You paid. Two fifty. So it's for twenty pounds and forty p used on Amazon, and it's got a decent rank. Nice. This we just got for free. You got a free little, the little ladybird book with every toy that you bought in Bernardo's. I reckon I bought like fifteen toys, but I just claimed one book, and this is for our niece. Yes. Well, she doesn't need fifteen of the same book. But, does and she? she won't be watching. So no. No spoilers there. <laughs> Uh, oh, and uh, this we were walking in, this is a different chasm, we were walking into a, a, a keech and I saw it just in the window display and I saw Storm, so I sort of said to Faye, Storm, and it's still got its plastic uh, thing over the badge, so obviously need to sort of check it out, but paid £6, so you, nice. were, you, you were kind of quite like, oh yes. Mm. Um, no marks on the bottom at all, so it doesn't look like it's been used. No. Which is nice. Got some games for you. Uh, just a little pile, and I've got another pile coming up later on. They grab this, 599. What? what was that noise? I don't know. 599. Was it in here? Or was it your phone? I don't know. Uh, Playmobil history. Only available new for £34.35 on Amazon. Really good rank, lots of reviews. Yahtzee. That is outrageous. Uh, I paid two fifty. I asked the lady to open it up in a shop because as I said, said before, either they've got no dice or no score pads or whatever. Uh, I paid two fifty. Sales for twenty four ninety nine used. This was a brand new and sealed Ravensburger for two pounds, just a hundred piece XXL. I can tell you before Faye scans it that it's not worth loads, but I couldn't leave it behind with quarter four coming up. Uh, I hope to hold out for a higher price. Seven pound ninety eight. Excellent rank though. I thought this was a puzzle. So this is like race night, John Franklin's wacky races. So you know you get like the race nights with horses and stuff. I think we've got like. 
monkeys racing or something. Hang on, cheese rolling. No, ignore the monkey thing. Oh no, hang on. Cheese rolling, mascot racing, tug of war, which is an orangutan versus a sumo wrestler, plus many more. And obviously you can see the sheep on the front. So uh, anyway, 250. He, John Franklin does like the traditional sort of race night stuff as well. It's a DVD game. Have you ever been to a race night? Uh, yeah, we used to do them at the golf club. Pretty good. Yeah. I've never been, but my parents have been to a few and they always really like them. Uh, 24.99 years. Monopoly Junior. Pay 250. I picture scanned this one in the shop because the label was over the barcode. Oh, it's Junior Party. It's a different one to the normal Monopoly Junior is not worth picking up. 14.99 used. Shout. We've sold this in the last month, I think, paid two pound fifty for it. This is used. Eighteen ninety nine used. Good one to find new. Thirty seven pound. Uh, Ravensburger. It's a hundred piece XL again. This is used though. This one paid two pounds. Only available new for ten pound forty three, but really good rank. So holding on for quarter four on that one. Memories of the 70s, Gibsons, these do well. We have the, we've had the 40s, 50s, 60s, all the rest of it, probably this one before as well. Uh, paid 2 95 obviously it's unchecked. Only available use, 29 95 Nice, what do you think of that? Oh, we didn't, did we do that? Yeah. Yeah, as I said, oh. it was horrible. Oh yeah. Do you want to see some more clothes? <laughs> <laughs> okay, this next one is the most expensive item of clothing I picked up. Um, I'm going to do some research and if it's no good, I'm going to take it back. Let us know in the comments what you think about this. It's an All Saints, like, cardigan thing. Paid £20. It's a medium. Now, Insert your emoji there. <laughs> it's made from 56% mohair and 13% wool and a bit of nylon as well. Um, but the mohair thing's what got me. It's really good condition. Would you have picked that up? <clears throat> These are all from a variety of shops now. I've done my, that big haul from one shop. Uh, next is this men's musto jumper. This is a size medium and this was four pounds. It's really good condition. Again, this doesn't even look like it's been worn. Mm. Then I think this next like nothing on the elbows or anything no this next one was inspired by geordie chittle hunt on instagram it's a blanket here it's not the sort of blanket i'd like it's incredibly itchy but it's mohair so 75 percent mohair 25 percent wool made in scotland for andrew mcandrew freezer looks like it's not fraser so no, I'll have to look at the label. Um, here's the label. Hang on. <laughs> I can't see. No, you, you're not really going to see that. Oh, okay. Either. But I paid three ninety nine for that one. Itchy ear. Uh, this was the brand new tag Fat Face. It's a size ten, and it was six pounds. There's the brand new tags, ladies. Nice autumn winter cash top. And then we have so was this one? I can't remember what this was made of. Is it anything special? Yeah, cashmere and lamb's wool blend. Just a white stuff jumper, but it's sort of white stuff season. And again, this looks really good condition. It's got mm. a couple of bubbles on it. The but bubbles I, are just coming straight off by hand though. Yeah. Uh, that was five ninety nine, size sixteen. Well, probably bubbles from something else. Yeah. Uh, then I picked up this poetry top, three pound forty nine, long sleeve. I don't know if this is anything, is it linen blend or anything. Yeah, fifty percent lin linen, thirty five percent cotton, fifteen percent silk. And this is a new brand. Haven't heard of this. So I was looking for jumper dresses today because. Uh, I know they're very popular and came across this it's knitted it's quite funky it's brand new with tags the tags I'm sure it's brand new with tags or did I make that up 
Might have made that up. I don't know, but it was six pound ninety-five. It's not a brand new attack. Forget that. And it's plenty by Tracy Reese, petite dress. And some of this does all right um, by her. So I grabbed it. It was a bit different. Bit of a pattern, isn't it? Yeah. I see you coming in there. Yeah. And then I've got Max Studio large, sort of. I don't know, that's that dress, it's very short, kind of like a tunic, £6.95. I've got a hush, just a long sleeve hush sort of t-shirt. This is a size large and it was £3.50. Keeps falling off the hanger. This one's funky. Look at that. Yeah. In the back. What do you call that? It's a jacket. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Not when you're going out in the rain in. No, size medium. The brand is Indigo Moon and they do sort of quite funky applique style garments and that was five ninety five. I did look it up in the shop, can't remember prices, but um it was worth picking up. Bit grubby around the collar. Like, just point it out now, just so you don't miss it. No. I don't know, this was the first item of clothing. It's actually the first thing I picked up today. Um, it's this Timberland jumper on the ladies' rail. It's large, and it says Baby Alpaca on the label. It was 5 95 When Faye handed to, this to me in the shop, first thing I thought was cat owner. But Oops. I think it's actually just the... Yeah. The alpaca. It's a hundred percent alpaca, I didn't realise. Yes, it's it's like is this what you'd be covered in if you had a pet alpaca? Don't put it. <laughs> it's a hundred percent alpaca jumper. Timberland. Wow. And then and then a spirit of the Andes cardigan. This feels like it's unworn. Really tough when I found this. It's a medium and it's £4.50. And mm. it's like a nice sort of peachy colour, autumn colour. Yeah. Hey, I'm super tough. Is that all my clothes or have I still got more? Still got more. A few more games for you now for, I think they're all for Amazon. Uh, Wits End, paid four ninety nine. Don't think I've seen this before. I sold it before. It's pretty no. big and heavy. I, I, when we, I saw it on the counter, I thought, oh, I've not seen that. That's a good one to pick up new at £69. Pounds. Mm. Used £26. Well done. Uh, Trivial Pursuit Family Edition. Mm. I keep picking these up. They're sort of, they're, they're not worth like those. Um, kind of bread and butter, aren't they? Yeah, they are bread and butter, but they, that's the thing they sell. So it yeah, has bread and butter. Even more so coming up. And also I've still got a few sort of bits and pieces, spares and stuff. So I'm always confident in picking them up that if they're not complete, I can complete them. £13.49 used, but they'll just do really well for quarter four. Anything like that does. Paid, paid three quid. Paid two pounds for this one. Connect for advanced. We've sold this a few times. Oh, this is good. £44.61 used, no new. Uh, as is this, I think it's Disney Junior. Junior, guess who? Wow. Uh, paid two pounds. Only available new at sixty-two pounds. Great rank. Yeah, it's just an easy sort of twenty-five, thirty quid there. You use. I keep scanning my laptop keyboard and keeps coming up with a replacement keyboard for an Ovo idea pad. <laughs> So this is Hatchimals Collectibles The Adventure Game. I paid five pounds. Um, new 29 pound, used uh, 20. And finally from me on the games, D Despicable Me, I found it, hidden picture game. I paid two pounds for this. Out of stock. Lots of reviews and a decent rank for something that's out of stock. Would you like to see some more clothes? <laughs> First up, we have this barber country kind of rugby shirt style polo long sleeve. This is on the ladies section. I'm assuming it's ladies. 
Ladies, where's the price tag? There we go. Size 12, yep. Yeah. And it cost £4.50. These go for decent money. Can't remember how much, but I looked it up in the shop. I picked up some sea salt because it was spotty. I, t I t told myself I wasn't going to pick up sea salt anymore because I don't sell it that quick. But I haven't had polka dots, and polka dots is a popular pattern. Uh, it's a size 16, and I paid £4.50 for it. The lady in the shop really was annoyed that I bought this jumper, I think. I think she wanted it. It's pure cashmere, John Lewis jumper, paid £9, and it is very soft. And I've just noticed a hole, so I'm going to take that back tomorrow. Uh, I spotted one with a hole that didn't I as you were handing yeah. it over, so we've already given... We gave one back, so yeah. that's going back. What else was going back? Nothing. Oh, those Marks and Spencer's trousers that I accidentally bought. Oh, they're up there now, aren't they? <laughs> it's all right, I know which ones they are. And then because it's um, autumn winter... Is that the same shop? Sorry. No. no. Um, I picked up this fat face cardigan, which is like not sitting on a hanger very well, because it was £1.50, so I can sell that. It's £1.50. Next is a manta ray dress. Now this is a bit of a pun. It's a maxi dress, but it's kind of like a nice one with tights and boots for this. No, it's a midi dress for this time of year. It was reduced to £4 and it's a size 20. Nice of a denim jacket or a biker jacket or something. And then I did mean to buy this. This is like a sort of jumper dress. Um, this is Marks and Spencer's and it's a size 16, it was £4, but I just thought that's very autumn winter. And a skirt. This one is Fat Face, size 16, reduced to £2. Again, great with tights and boots and a nice jumper. It's got pockets. Everyone loves a pocket. And this was reduced to three pound. It's a nice white soft dress. Again, great with a jacket and boots and tights. Size 18. Sea salt, five pounds. Size. What size is it? 14. It's a nice shirt. I did leave some mint velvet behind today. It was brand new with tags at a size eight, I think. So, yeah, you said eight, yeah. Um, I was gonna go back for it, but then I thought, nah, do you know what? It was, it was six pounds, so I, we were chatting about it over lunch, and I was like, oh, I can't believe you didn't pick it up because it's brand new with tags. I sort of thought the rule was if it was brand new with tags, it kind of, you know, and the right price. I was going to go back and then we were up against it time-wise, weren't we? So I didn't. Um, but this was £3. This is mint velvet, size 10. 10, but for £3. Might put it on the mint velvet Facebook group. Oh, might you. I might. And then finally for the clothes, I've got these Ping golf trousers for 4 95 They're a size 32. Quite funky quite funky mm. and that is all the clothes was it did you count 37 38 37 37 37 items of clothing so that if i can get i've got to get 19 things listed by the end of the week to do it to have done 100 this week so we were getting the dog screened as we mentioned earlier um we dropped them off about 10 minutes away and then we hit two towns within that area um so we dropped the dogs off at one and we were back picking the dogs up at five and everything that you've seen in this video is what we sourced in that time plus we had lunch in so a pub. i think in, in, a, in a pub yeah so i think we've done incredibly well let us know what you think would you have uh, picked up any of these would you have left any of them behind please comment let us know what you think if you like the video please uh hit the thumbs up if you're not subscribed why not hit that subscribe and the notifications so you can see when our videos are coming out. I'm buzzing. <laughs> what, oh, what was your favourite pickup? Oh, uh, oh, well, we were talking about, yeah, it was going to be that DVD, but it's not the DVD anymore because it was the part two. 
Uh, I'm going to go for one of these games. I think I'm going to go for, or just because it was new to me, uh, Challenge Your Mind. So maybe we'll give this one a go before I sell it. We've still got to play um, Trivial Pursuit Globetrotters. We haven't done that yet. Uh, 4 99 this one was, and it uh, was for about 30, was it? Or something, I think 25, so, yeah. 30. So yeah, I'm going to go with this because, uh, you know, something different. What was your favourite pickup? All the clothes. <laughs> All of them. <laughs> All of them. Quite pleased with the musto trousers, uh, like the alpaca Timberland jumper. I mm. mean, some of that stuff for like between two and five pounds or whatever is incredible. That Those coats and jackets and stuff, the, mm. the fishing stuff. Absolutely blinding. Yeah, thanks. And I'm going back tomorrow, so fingers crossed there's some other good stuff. Yeah, stay tuned for the next haul video. See if they does get anything uh, tomorrow. That video will be coming out soon if she does. Thanks very much. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Bye.